Happy Monday, y'all. As you can see, yeah, Lippy's been in the sugar shack all day. Mm -hmm. I don't know if y'all can even see. Y'all can't see behind me. But I've been making salves all day. Stock was getting low. Orders are getting a little bit higher. Thank you very much. So, I've been whipping out the salves, and I looked up, and I said, oh, no. We have a ball game at 6. We have a ball game at 7. Cameron and Moe's playing today because half of their games this weekend, it was called like a scrimmage. Now, y'all, I don't know nothing about no baseball. I just go and watch. But because of the storms, they canceled. So, they're coming back today to finish it up. That's all I can tell you. But I was like, oh my Lord, I was supposed to post the planting tree video. So I was able to capture it yesterday. So I'm gonna insert that part of Cameron and Mo helping Buddy plant a plum tree. But I wanna give y'all a little story. Cameron was three. He's gonna be 12 in July. So, nine years ago, he was between two and three. So, nine years ago, he had got him a garden set. You know, the little shovel, the little rake and stuff. You know, the little wooden handle and the metal ends. And Buddy wanted to plant some red leaf maples. Papa, I dig. So, before we move to the video, I want to insert these photos of Cameron helping his paw. Now, back then, I didn't know what a video was, but I do have two pictures to share. And then we'll move into the video. And while I was taking the video, I also took uh, still shots of Mo planting these trees. So now I can have them printed and I can have when Cameron was three to Cameron yesterday helping his pawpaw and I'll put them side by side. I will print Mo helping Papa. And when Mo gets to be mm, 11 or 12, I'm gonna have him plant another tree. The memories I'll be able to pass down to them children. So it's gonna be a Mo in action kind of video. I'm also gonna share a lot of times y'all won't see Cameron doing a lot of physical activity. Some days he is just amazing. Other days he has a little bit of a backseat he has to take. Cameron does have EDS. And some days it affects him, some days it doesn't. Um, but the days that, you know, he's not, I would call, full mobility. I mean, he's always mobile, but sometimes he has some little aches and pains. He's in the kitchen. Y'all, I think Cameron is going to be a chef. I'm not telling him that, but between us, that child is amazing in the kitchen. And it comes natural. So, you know, that just tickles me pink. It truly tickles me pink. But I hope you enjoy the video. And it's not long, you know, six, seven minutes. Uh, but it's worthy of just watching. They are so funny. And of course, y'all know, Mo. I have been tempted to set the camera just to the side and just capture a day in a life with Mo and not let him know. And then I'll go in and just take out the, you know, the dead spots. Because I'm going to tell you what. Y'all don't realize he's on this side, he on this side, he's over here, he's over yonder. But he's always busy and he's always productive. Because yesterday before the tree planting, he got in that trailer and he shoveled. For every scoop Papa shoveled, Mo shoveled. The child thinks work is fun. We ain't telling him no different. Mm -mm. No, we're going we're gonna to enjoy it while it last, but something tells me it's going to last and last and last. <laughs> and 
And that's from the time his feet gets up. But when he hits that bed, forget it. He's gone. Like, he's gone. But I got to stop jaw jacking. I got to get ready to go. Oop, air condition just kicked on to a ball game. So enjoy the clip. And I'll be back at the end. Oh, you're like a monkey on that. I'm oh, kind of like a fireman slides down the fireman pole, huh? Yeah. What y'all fixing to do? Plant a tree. Plant a tree? That's why we have a shovel. Oh, that's why you have a shovel. Well, what kind of tree is that that you're planting? I have no idea. What does the picture say on the tree? An apple tree. Oh, it's an apple tree. Okay. So you plant an apple tree. No, we're not. Hey, Grayson. What did Papa tell you that tree was? Uh, a plum. A plum, not plum. an apple. It's a plum. I was thinking that sure looks like a funny apple. It's a plum. I want y'all to look at this, that photo that I inserted. That was when Cameron was three years old. Helping he's Papa. Up here. Yep, helping Papa plant where they red leaf maples. And yep, now we're planting a, pl a plum tree. Seven years, well, he's gonna be 12 in July. So almost nine years later, y'all. And he's helping Papa plant a tree. Doing orchard. Good job, Cameron. Good can job. Go, can I go now? I do want to. We want it bigger around and deeper, and then we're going to backfill it. I want to do it. You want to do it? Yeah. I know you do. And this is going to be Mo's first time to help Papa plant a tree. Yep. Cameron was three. Mo, how old are you? Five. 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 Big five. Now Mo has a shovel. Mighty Mo. Mighty Mo. And look at Mighty Mo go. <laughs> Mo, you strong, boy. Tell them what kind of shovel that is. Uh, I don't know. So that's a man shovel. Oh, you don't like Mama's it's little the, shovels, Mo? Uh, that's, that's not his shovel, that little oh. one. He likes that big one. I like the big one. You sure? Yep. Bubba trying to give you a small shovel? Yeah. Let me show let me show y'all something that you two ain't got yet, okay? It's oh. called weight. <laughs> huh? Weight. Get a little weight on it. You can make it go. There you go, Mo. Clean the bottom out. Okay. <laughs> so what you backfilling it with, Paul? Some of that good old white sand mix, compo mushroom compost. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of I like to put my root starter in there. I'm gonna set it in there and see where it is. I'm gonna check the height. Oh, we will when we fill it up. I'm gonna check the height. We don't wanna to be too deep. You think? What do you think, Mo? He said, I think we're way too deep. 
first scoop in there. Alright. Just spread it out here and check it again. I think we're good right there. So now we're gonna lay it down. Roll them up. Slide it over here. Pull it out and set it in the hole. And then we'll adjust it. Give me in the head. <laughs> yeah. Get you in the head, Fred. Alright. Now we need to fill in around it. Do that when I hit the tree. Yep. Put it right there. Drag it on down. Take your finger, pack it in. Now we want to make sure she's sitting straight. Pack it in. This is gonna look pretty whenever it all grows. Oh, it's gonna be beautiful when it all grows, yes. You're doing an amazing job, Mo. That poison ivy is making me sneeze. Oh, you think that poison ivy on that old cedar tree is making me sneeze? Yes. Because some poison ivy can make you sneeze. Well, I sure didn't know that. I know it sure can make you swell up and eat. It's a landscaper rake. A landscaper rake? And how do you use it, Mo? So if you want to rake, you use this side. Right. If you just like swing the end in there, uh, you use the back side which is that side right there. Uh -huh. You can push dirt in to make that uh, smooth. Yeah, to make that smooth. Well, that's a cool rake. Well, we're going to have to bust some of this up. I thought that's what Mo was doing. Don't hit the tree at all. Oh. Get it broke up, boy. I'll spread it. That looks really good. Wasn't that fun? I, I'm so glad I had the camera on. Because when he jumped up on that uh, shovel and slid down, I was like, you know, only Mo would think of something like that. But I hope you enjoyed the short clip. I don't know what tomorrow's going to bring. We'll do something. We'll figure something out. But I got to get ready to go to this game. So I'm just going to go ahead and throw this up. Not a whole lot of editing. I don't do a lot of editing anyway. Who am I fooling? But as always, stay safe, stay well, and God bless. And I will see you on the next one. Go plant a tree.